In this video, I'll show you how to add a featured product section on your homepage. Let's get straight into it. Example on this particular site, if we scroll down here, we've got a featured category. But what we want to actually do is create a featured product section like this. So, for example, I'm showing all these products which are on sale, or we can even handpick a few selected products in which we want to highlight on our homepage or anywhere else on our site for that matter. OK, so with that being said, let's get straight into it. All right. So let's head over to our dashboard. And the first thing we want to do is go ahead and actually specify a few featured products. So I'm just going to navigate over to products or products and then here we can quickly specify a few featured products so we can click on this star icon right and now this particular product has been set to featured so we can actually speed up the process even more for example we can select a few products and then let's go ahead and click on edit apply and then here where it says featured we'll go ahead and set this to yes and then just update OK, so as I said, we've specified a few products as they're featured here. And in a second, you'll see why that's needed. All right. So let's head back over to our home page. I'm going to go ahead and edit this particular page. All right. So we're going to add our featured product section. All right. So I'm just going to add it just below here. So I'm going to search for a heading block. Just going to paste in our heading here. And I just want this to be centered. Let's do space. And we're going to add our featured product using a short code. So with this short code, you can use it with any other page builder you're using, whether that's Elementor, Divi, or any other page builder. So we'll do brackets and then featured underscore and then products and then close brackets. All right. So now we can just hit update and let's preview this page. OK, and here we've got a list of all our featured products. OK, so I've actually got a few featured products. All right, so let's say you wanted to limit the amount to be shown. We'll just head back over here. We'll open up our brackets and then we'll say limit equals quotation mark. And let's say four, for example. All right, so that looks good. Let's hit update again and then let's refresh this page. Okay, and now this has been limited to only display four products. Okay, so that's using our featured products shortcode. Now we can actually do it using a particular block. So we can do slash and then products. And then I'm going to select handpick products here. And then from here, we can actually select specific products to display in our featured product section. Once you're happy with the changes, just hit done. OK, so that looks fine. If we wanted to make it full width like the rest of the pages, we just need to go ahead and tweak our settings. And now since we've moved it within the container of our existing design, now it's actually stretching to the appropriate width. So we can delete this as well and we can add back our shortcode. Let's update. And here you can see it's taken up the appropriate width to be in keeping with our design. Like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave in the comment box.